Hi guys, this is DJ Arson of H8 speaking with another Garden Railway update. Now as you can see, there's been a bit of progress, so I'll go into a bit more detail. The first uh, major change to the garden is of course the bridge. Now the bridge is the key component of the whole railway, as it's basically we're using it as a level point. Now above the bridge at this end is the, the highest point of the uh, line, and below the bridge is the uh, lowest point. This, of course, will all have to be raised up into an embankment uh, and then all the way along here as well, once all these plants have been removed or relocated. And uh, so basically the bridge is what is the actual key component because the, uh, there's got to be a cutting at the top as well to, uh, as you can see, the track is slightly uh, sloping. We have temporarily laid the track on there as well purely because, uh, so we can see uh, how the uh, stock is going to sit on the bridge and also get the right width uh, for the uh, towers which will go on each side of the bridge uh, one there one there and one there and one there which will uh, support the cables which will create the overall suspension bridge effect now this all here will be all raised up this is just temporarily uh, sitting on top of there that is because we want to check that the radius of the track would be enough to get it from around the corner off the end of the bridge into a nice sort of straight before it will go into the flexi track which will take the sweeping curve all the way up to the uh, flowers up there as you can see, some of the plants have been removed from here and uh, at the other end, the same on the other side. So without further ado, I will take you over to this side and uh, have a look over there. Right, we are now on the other side of the pond and as you can see, the track comes straight off the uh, bridge there and into a little curve. Now, of course, there's got to be a cutting dug down here as well, but um, as you can see so far, all the plants have been removed from along here, very kindly by Manana Gramp. Uh, taking out which ones are the ones which are uh, need to be uh, sort of relocated and the ones that are you know don't need to be relocated i.e. weeds and other things that wouldn't uh, which, which would interfere with the track bed but as you can see it's sort of very uneven but it's sort of just set up to give the idea of where the curve is going to come in then the track will come into a nice straight here where there will hopefully be a pair of points somewhere around here and hopefully in theory it should be in level with this um, concrete here and uh, part of the track will be set up on this concrete temporarily. Whether or not we go, um, it, the layout will ever go any further around through there or not to give it a nice smoother curve, I do not know. But for the time being, the, as, as is on the plans, it will come in from along there, around here, and off into those plants there. So I think that's all for this uh, very short little update. Uh, I thought I'd do this just because the weather is uh, pretty nice at the moment and we've got the bridge in place temporarily. But uh, I'm sure next time when we get some more good weather or when we get a bit more done, I'll do another update. So uh, that's all for now. And anyway, it's been SDJR, Senef88 speaking, and uh, thanks for watching.